Greeting guys, this is your boy TK Junior. Welcome back to my channel. For today's intro, it won't be long. We just keep things short because on the first video, I already explained what that. this channel will be about. What are we customizing on today's video? You must have already seen the title. We are customizing a... And without wasting time, let's get to it. <laughs> On today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to customize this plain white superga. If you watched my previous video, you already know why there are no shoelaces. Stay tuned till the end to see how it turned out. Just like our previous pair, these two is made of canvas. For this project, I used a palette, paint brushes, and a blue dye fabric paint. And let's begin. The first thing we're going to do is to paint the whole kick blue. Make sure to apply the paint thoroughly. I made sure that every visible canvas section of this shoe is painted blue. Voila! This is what we have now. From plain white canvas to this beautiful canvas. <laughs> See what I did there. Now that we have our blue superga, we're gonna get our masking tape and make a stencil. Here's how. A DIY stencil. This is the fastest way to accurately paint these shapes on our kick. Our stencil is reusable which saves us a lot of time and energy. Let's get creative and make a pattern of this. After we are done with our drop like patterns, to spice them up, I added border lines around them. For this part, I used my detailing brush and the blue paint to create these small curvature lines. The next step is to add these lines at the back of our shoe to create columns. Do you remember the border lines we did for our drop like shape? Yes, now we only paint those border lines inside these columns. We are not done.
We finna make this trip. Again, if you have watched my video prior to this one, you know how we do this trip thing. Thank you for watching. If you've watched until here, please like, subscribe, and tap on that bell icon.